Hi guys, um, Fit and Fun here with a very special guest. Uh, we have Heather Baker from Mascara Beauty. She helped us out when um, with the I Feel Pretty contest and she gave a giveaway to our lucky winner. And so she's here to talk to us about some summer makeup tricks, hacks, tips, and we're excited you're here. Thank you for having me. Yes. I really appreciate it. Welcome. Um, okay, well, I guess we'll just dive right in then, right? Let's do it. Okay, so I was thinking, what are like five to ten top tum summer tips for you guys? And the first thing that comes to mind in the summertime is sunscreen. Um, healthy skin and, um, you know, that is probably the number one most important thing in the summertime. To wear your sunscreen, to avoid aging, but most importantly, to avoid any kind of you, bad UV rays um, so that you can avoid skin cancer and all those terrible things. So first things first is I love floppy hats for the summertime pool <laughs> days. Because <laughs> it's really important to keep your face Yes, covered. it's important yes. to keep your face covered from the shade. Um, I'm sorry, from the sun. And um, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and also, of course, sunscreen. Number one, probably most important thing. Um, I have two sunscreens here, just sun bum in a 30. If you're going to wear it on your face, I highly recommend doing a 50. Um, of any kind, but um, you know, 30 is better than none. That's my favorite sunscreen. Yeah, sun bum, I love it. It smells so good. And then Elta MD Skincare, I just actually got introduced to this um, a couple weeks ago and I really love it. This one has a tint in it, so if you're at the beach or at the pool and you're with your girlfriends or whatever and you slap on some lip gloss or lipstick or whatever and this has a little bit of a tint so you can kind of glow and it's really pretty on and give you a light coverage but yeah, still yeah and it's water fresh. resistant and um you know lightly tinted with sunscreen so i love this stuff too also um, mascara beauty carries a stay spray which prolongs the life of your makeup throughout the day but i find in the mornings even when i'm not wearing makeup um that i will just spray this on because there's 30 spf in it Oh, that's cool. Um, so something to know about Mascara Beauty is our makeup does not have sunscreen in it. Um, and the reason for that is because of whenever you photograph our makeup in any kind of photos, sunscreen is what kind of makes your face a different color. So, like, you can leave for a party looking one way in your mind, and you'll see a picture. Oh. And, and you're white. And that your face right. looks white. Yes. A different yes. color than your body, even yes. though it looked the same in your in your mirror, in the lighting in your bathroom. Exactly. So, yeah, that but is your the face. Worst. <laughs> yes, yes. I'm picturing myself this one night. Yes, so that's why mascara beauty does not have sunscreen in their makeup because they want you to look just like you left the house, you know, in your photos. So they did um, provide sunscreen in their stay spray. Okay. Awesome. So this is twenty nine dollars, but it lasts literally forever, um, and I spray it multiple times a day. Um, that make you glow a little bit too. Well, it just is a great primer for your makeup. It sets your makeup, but um, I mean, makeup. You know, yeah, no, it's just mostly a primer, and it makes your makeup stay all day. Um, um, what is the the word I'm looking for? <laughs> You're not makeup dumb. Sweet, just not makeup dumb. Uneducated. Oh yeah, makeup dumb. A little, okay. a little. No. <laughs> <laughs> that's what uneducated means. Well, that's, okay, go on. <laughs> okay. So speaking of skincare, um, taking care of your skin is just so important. Like I said, pretty healthy skin wears makeup better. That makes sense, right? You know, yeah. you don't want a lot of acne. You don't want a lot of skin damage. You don't want a lot of spotting and different things on your face because no matter what type of makeup you're wearing, it won't look that great, right? So the number one most important thing is skincare. And we have a beautiful skincare line, um, Mascara Beauty does, and it's called Milk. Um, there are so many active ingredients for anti-aging. Um, of course, I'm not a dermatologist, so I don't have like a whole list of all the funny names that they have in here, mm -hmm. but um, it is like 16% milk um, and so super moisturizing. I've seen before and after pictures that would blow your mind of people who have rosacea and it really... Mm. Uh, so it doesn't their, irritate the skin, no, it's yeah, gentle. It's super calming and super moisturizing. It really smells amazing. Does and, it get the um, makeup off? Because I have a hard time sometimes when I wash my face, I, it, I, the, their makeup is still on there. It's probably why I break out. So my nightly routine includes a makeup remover wipe, either by Neutrogena or our um, Mascara Beauty So wipes. do you do this first, uh, yeah. and then you follow I, with I the face wash? I completely remove okay. all of my makeup, and then I follow with our Milk Moisturizer um, face wash, and then spray the toner, and then apply the Milk um, Night Cream. Um, a lot of times I don't recommend using this thick cream in the mornings because you're going to throw on makeup afterwards, and your makeup probably won't lay as beautifully as it would um, because this is so thick. So this is a really great night cream. In the daytime, I would use just like a sunscreen, let it soak in, and then apply your makeup, okay? Um, or just apply, you know, the stay spray before you apply your makeup. It has SPF in it. So 
Um, and then talking about nighttime routine, that is part of my nighttime routine. But sometimes, about twice a week, I will take what I call uh, what they're called tinkle razors. So some women might think, "Ew, gross! She shaves her face." Well, it's actually very important to shave your face. It's great for exfoliation, and also. Um, you know, it gets rid of that name. I, mean, I know the tinkle right. razors, and they come in different colors, and they're on Amazon. Amazon, I got and my I, own Amazon. Yeah, yeah, and they're like a whole bundle for like super cheap, and they last forever. Gets rid of that peach fuzz. Yeah, it gets rid of the peach fuzz, and also um, helps exfoliate your face. Um, and your makeup looks better. It right? looks really pretty. It goes, yeah. it goes better. It yeah, applies better. Totally. So, and speaking of exfoliation, I found through all my mascara beauty girls, um, all of us who sell it, they're like, oh my gosh, this is the best exfoliant. Also on Amazon, it's called Cure. You guys, I put this on twice a week after I've done my whole nightly routine before I apply my moisturizer, and it literally balls your skin. Like you'll feel, oh, wow, your your skin will be balled up. You can feel it, and it's kind of disgusting, but it takes off that layer of like glue. Yeah, it yeah. is. It really is, and so it takes off that kind of gross layer of your skin. And so um, one thing I do know about skin is that it's a 28 day cycle. So I've seen before and after pictures after 28 days of using this routine. It's amazing. So cool. I have a friend that has rosacea really bad. I have a friend that has melasma pretty bad. And the results are um, pretty impressive. So if you're ever interested in trying the milk products, let me know. But also, um, definitely shave your face. <laughs> Sounds weird, but you should do it. Tinkle your face. You should sweeter, try it. Right? Yeah, tinkle your face. Tinkle your face. <laughs> Okay, so um, also one re another reason why it's important to kind of get rid of that peach fuzz is because Mascara Beauty is a cream-based makeup. So um, a lot of people are scared to try creams because they're kind of like, oh, I don't like, you know, the way they feel. They're very heavy. That means that. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, exactly. Um, you know, they don't want, they're afraid it's going to smudge or smear. What are some other questions I get? Does it sit in my wrinkles and fine lines? It actually does all of the opposite of that. Anything that's kind of mixed with like a powdery base or um, that is where you're going to find it sitting in your creases. Um, okay. So cream base really kind of moves about your face uh, in, in a good way. Fluid, like it doesn't fluid. Yeah, it doesn't sit in your wrinkles. Look how smart I'm sounding. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Throw in those words. Yeah. It's good. Blew it. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so, uh, but the stay spray will help allow it just stay right there. And also, I personally find that like that dewy, youthful glow is in, but also super healthy looking. Yeah, that's what I've noticed about um, your before and afters is that everyone looks so fresh and glowy. They don't look overdone. They just look younger and vibrant and oh, just you. fresh. Yeah. Like. I really, I believe that too, and that's part of the reason, like, I just totally fell in love with this brand when I tried it as a customer because of that. So, I just feel like it's youthful, young, and it is for all ages. Like, I just did my daughter who's 15, and I just had a customer who's, like, 70 send me an uh, after oh, picture. Oh, I saw that. Yeah, she looked great. Yeah, well, she, and that one, the one I posted recently, she's probably in her 50s, but um, I had another one send me an after picture, and she just loves it. So, um, so speaking of mascara beauty, it's a highlight and contour makeup. So contouring is new to people, but like I was recently asked if I got my lips injected, which is kind of a funny thing, but, and all I did was contour my lips. Like I just put a little bit of a darker line on the bottom of my lip and it gives you that more um, pop. plump. Yeah. yeah. So contour is super versatile. You can do so much with it. You can make your nose look smaller. You can make your cheeks look more chiseled. You can line your lips, make your lips look bigger. You can line your eyebrows with it. You can line your eyes with it. Super cool stuff. And, um, it's an art. Yeah, it kind of is. I know? learned. I so I learned how to do all that when I was like thirteen or fourteen. When I went to modeling school, that was one of the things they taught us how to apply makeup oh, and literally highlight and contour. And you know, of course, they did it to your own face. Yeah. So you remember those things, but did it a lot more when I was younger and had the time. <laughs> yeah. just, psh, let's go. Well, of course. Yeah. And um, that is so true. A lot of women are like, Heather, we don't have time for all of this. And actually, like, I do throw this on even just before running errands, and I can do it in five minutes. If you have the time, then you sit and you play with it. Play with it. Yeah. Take yeah. longer. But it can be thrown on. It's four steps. It's highlight, contour, blush, lip, uh, cheek lip, and an illuminator, the kind of dewy glow. Um, and they come in these beautiful little compact cases. So pretty. I love them. Which, if you've seen my videos, probably some of you have, um, you know, you can see. Where is your videos? Where do they go to so see So, if you go to um, Mascara Effect on Instagram. Spell that. M-A-S-K-C-A-R-A. -A -A, mascara. M-A-S-K-C-A-R-A. -A -A, effect. A-F-F-E-C-T. 
um, on Instagram, Mascara. Method. We'll and we'll uh, link you up too. Oh, yes, perfect. We'll post the link. But yes. okay, perfect. And then also, um, Mascara Beauty with Heather, be beautiful inside and out is my Facebook group page. Um, Remember, yeah, that's where you do your tutorials. Right? That's where I do a lot of the tutorials. Yeah. You can see more of the mascara product and kind of how it's applied and stuff like that. Um, so we won't get into all that tonight, but we have a lot of beautiful brushes, beautiful eyeshadows, tons of different color options and things like that. So, um, but moving on for a minute, another thing I love to do is self tan because I feel like the real deal isn't healthy, right? Of course, all of us. In Texas, we can't really avoid it's it. Yeah, it's hard. it's hard to avoid it. Yeah, some sun is healthy. Some sun you do need because it helps you produce vitamin D. So it's it's good for you in small amounts. Totally. Fifteen to twenty minutes a day is all you need. Anything totally. more than that, air, I mean, just running errands, yes. you get that. You know. Yes. Yeah, I mean, through our well, sun some groups, people, you know, some people don't get out of the house. <laughs> that's true. But, that's true. Yes. Yeah. That's true. Yeah. But well, yeah, now that we've like shipped. That yes, kind of stuff, that's and perfect. the people yeah. that work in, oh, you know, Amazon. cubicles oh, and offices, and, yeah. offices office and they're inside white. all day. That's what they, they call yes. it office white. So that's why people are depressed. So vitamin D is very good for you, and it actually helps fight cancer, but you never, ever want to burn. No. So just enough to get slightly pink. Yeah. After that, put on some sunscreen or some clothing to yes. protect yourself. 100%. Yes. So um, instead of, you know, for special occasions, I'll go get that $40 spray tan or whatever, the one-time $50 tan. Um, but otherwise, throughout the week in the summer, I love to slap on a little bit of self-tanner. And these are the two wipes that I swear by. So um, this is tan towel, and it's in, I don't know if you guys can see from back there, it's kind of shadowed, but it's an orange and white box, and you can buy them at Ulta. Um, look good this, naked, that's what, that's what it says. says. That's what it says. I look mean, is it really going to make me look good naked? <laughs> I think put a little extra here for me, a little bit of my, <laughs> my, my yeah, chunky sure. areas look better when they're darker. You know what I mean? Yeah, so yeah. true. Okay, so this is five tans, one towel. You rub it in a circular motion all over your body. It doesn't streak. You just try to really make it even. And circle motions is where it's at. You just got to make sure you. It's good for those tan lines too, right? <laughs> yeah. Put that on a shirt. Yeah. It's good for those, it's it's those tan lines that we get from. Running, you know, like yes. tennis, bathing suit. Yes, yes. when yeah. you got to get that fancy in style bathing suit top with the ruffle. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> so this one is at Ulta. It's twenty nine dollars for the five, um, and usually you pay that for one. You know, at a at a yeah. booth or whatever. And, and then kind of, these are a little bit cheaper. I see dark, so you can get medium. Yeah, there's dark, and then there's like extreme, and then there's. Um, I just always get the dark. I think dark is the. Good it says medium to dark skin tones. Okay. So it'll say on the box. And then this one's probably if you're Polish, cheaper. not the good, not the right one, not the right one. For the <laughs> <laughs> okay, L'Oreal Paris has one called Sublime Bronze, and you can get this at Target for cheaper than twenty nine dollars. I can't remember how much. And that one's medium, so if you're yeah, Polish, this one's it might medium. be okay. <laughs> this is six. Years. Sorry, so sorry for <laughs> Polish, Polish people <laughs> viewers. Oh my gosh, you guys are so funny. Okay. Um, and then in the summertime, do you guys love to paint your nails? Neither one of you. Have nail patch on. I do my toes. Oh. I can't. I. Because you you work in the medical industry, so you yeah, can. and I, I like to work in the garden a lot, and so they're always just messed up and yeah, old people what? work in gardens. Well, well, I love to go get my toes done too, but it's cathartic. I, I find that I do my own nails because I just feel the same way. I use my hands a lot, they yeah. chip, so it's my of husband cool. likes it. When my nails are it's weird. Yeah, it's pretty. Well, I just brought a fun little pinky nail polish because I think fun bright pink and love that time color. Yeah. Pretty. Yeah. Yeah, color. yeah, this one's by Orly, but I also think um, OPI has beautiful colors, and so does Essie. Essie's super affordable, and that's at Target. You can find all these fun pinks right now. So I'm a pink girl in the summer. Pretty um, pink. Okay, what else? Oh, I brought some lashes because... You know, for those of us that don't have all the time in the world to go lay and get them done all the time, or even all the money in the world to go get them done all the time and get them filled, I think it's fun for special occasions to throw on a fake lash. So all the mascara girls, all of us have found that Ardell Wispies are super affordable and really easy on your real lash. One thing to be careful about whenever you're using false lashes is that it will pull out your real lashes. So you just want to be careful um, in the application. They look really scary in the box, don't they? But I'm wearing them right now. And um, so do they, does it come with the glue? Yeah, it comes with you... the glue, which it, I brought, but it's probably in my other bag. Okay. That's right. um, but the glue is called um, Duo, a D-U-O, D-U-O, and it usually comes with this. But okay. this patch it, and then I had plenty of glue, so... Um, anyways, Ardell Wispies, and this is a multi-pack, and I think they were like $11. So think about how many events you can go. You know, these are reusable, so you can use them yeah. twice if you want. I never do. Because the glue. Yeah. I throw mine away. Yeah. yeah. I like, throw mine away. In the middle of the night, I take them off. Oh, yeah. Depends on how, how rough you were the night yes. before, whether or not they're like, reusable. Yeah. <laughs> a lot of girls um, reuse them, but I never Yeah, do. you can. But you can. If you take them off carefully and you put them back in. Yeah. Because yep. the glue, you just put more glue on. Yep. 
So think about how many special occasions you can use for those and they're super easy to apply really. You can just hop on YouTube or even some of my videos I do it. I don't really wear them as often as, you know, I say I do, but <laughs> I do love them when I wear them. Need well, lashes occasions. are great because yeah. if, I feel like if I have lashes on, I don't have to wear as much makeup. Yes. You know, I just feel more done and I can just literally throw on foundation, fill yeah. in my eyebrows, throw on some lip gloss, I'm done. Yep. Me totally. too. Yeah. Yeah. Every day. <laughs> and then when I'm not wearing lashes, I recommend um, uh, my favorite is Superhero by it, it Cosmetics, my favorite mascara. But there's so many amazing mascaras in the world. I just brought this just because this is what I use. And yeah, I love Lancome. Um, Defensils, I think it's called or something. Oh, okay, like that. I yeah. haven't tried that one. I've used it forever. It just really has very thin eyelashes naturally <laughs> and it just helps like separate them. And yeah. Well, and I've heard really amazing stuff about just plain old cheap Maybelline. Yeah. I mean, Oh yeah. Um, they're always in us weekly and people magazine mm -hmm. and I'm a fool for all those magazines. And every single time they make one of the top five uh, yeah. mascaras. I always see, my mom always gets me the extra, like the, the freebie. Free gift. That's yeah. What I use. yeah. That's how I, that's how I got the Lancome because oh, my mom yeah. gave yeah. it to me. It's yeah. a free gift for the little mini one. There you go. And in fact, I love ordering those. You can order them on Amazon, the little yeah. minis, because I feel like it goes like the big tubes go bad before I use it all. Yeah. And I'm like, this way I get two minis in there. Yeah, they say you should replace like every three months. Really? I would never go six months with you. Yeah. Really? Why? Well, you don't wear that much, but it just gets, bacteria grows in it and then it gets dry. Like yes. it's just, doesn't, it's not, doesn't apply as smooth. It gets kind of clumpy. Yes. Especially if you're using it every day because you're like yes. pumping, pumping air in it. Yes. Totally. <laughs> So one last thing I'll say about Mascara Beauty is that um, we're all about functionality and I don't know about you guys but I have a lot of travel coming up this summer and I just love the fact that we can throw these compacts in a bag and be done. You know, a lot of people have tons of product in their makeup bag that they don't even use and it's overflowing and right. it's crazy and you're traveling and you're like, oh, this is too much stuff. So it's literally all right here for you. Um, it's a highlight contour like I said. So here's my highlights, here's my contours, and this is my illuminator, and then I put my blushes on the other side with my bronzer. So this is the product that I have on my face literally right now. So those are like little magnetic? Magnets? Yeah, they're magnetic tins, cool. and they just go right in. Um, super easy to replace. They're $14 per color, which is so affordable when you think about um, going into Ulta and leaving with a bunch of stuff or Sephora, you know. One compact costs seventy five dollars, yeah. and you don't even have everything you need. So it's really neat. And you're not going to wear half of those colors in there. Yeah. <laughs> so it's really customizable. Really, I just really love it. And you just, you know, you don't have to buy it all at once. You just grow as you. Right. 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 Yeah. You know, buy as you can, grow your palette as you want. You know. Um, and so, lastly, when it comes to functionality, we have this beautiful clutch. It is um, Italian leather, and you can just it is. It, <coughs> excuse me. Is that a bug? <laughs> <laughs> Live We're video filming in nature. <laughs> nature. We're outside. It's summertime. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> it comes with a chain, so it can be a crossbody bag as well, but I forgot that, of course. But anyways, your makeup's in there. Um, oh, awesome. Yeah, it's really, really cool. You can just reapply. Perfect. Go. Yes, awesome. So, Is good? I feel like I talked in my own minute. I hope I think that you did great. everybody... Yes, uh, yes. When I was thrown down. Throw it down. <laughs> well, we had certainly appreciate um, you coming on and sharing your tips with us and this awesome makeup. I can't wait to try it. Uh, maybe we'll do some before and afters. Of I know you've done one. Yes, I have done um, one. Maybe I'll throw uh, that up on the website. Yeah, oh, there you go. Hey, um, and then if you guys have any questions for Heather, please um, put them in the comments, and she will be responding to those as well. Yeah, yes. totally, I will. Thank you for learning us. Thank you for Love having it. me. This was really fun. I'm sorry if I spoke too fast, but that's just the name of my game. Just rewind. <laughs> I just speak real fast. Thanks, guys. That's Have a, a great day. week. Bye.